Hello everyone. So yeah, today, like uh, yesterday, we will play some Laura's Jam game. I'm Jaren, and uh, I am a French indie game developer. I previously worked at Microsoft, uh, and uh, I have participated in the Laura's Jam, actually. I've made uh, Lueur, which is a uh, minimal city builder with uh, bits of uh, survival. Yeah, I, uh, as the last light in the world, and uh, you must uh, resist to darkness. Oh so, yeah, if you like a city builder, you can try it. And today, uh, yeah, we will play some uh, Lowest Jam game. For reminder, Lowest Jam is uh, a game jam where you have two weeks to create a game with a six, uh, 64 by 64 resolution, which is pretty low. Um, yeah, so we will start right now with uh, M glitch. Uh, don't hesitate if uh, the sound is too loud or something uh, to tell uh, in the chat. I will look at the chat between games. And uh, I will try to avoid playing too long to games, like 30 minutes max per game. So yeah, let's go. So Memglish uh, is a, yeah, uh, for a reminder, this is to help developers. So I will take a look at the page and uh, provide feedback during gameplay. Um, top down adventure. Uh, upon starting the game, you're required to enter a world, see the generation. So it's a, uh, yeah, top down uh, procedural generation. The game can be confusing at first. Generally, you cannot ascend up and steep inclines. So if you cannot find your way onto a block, try seeing if there is a ramp near. Okay. Yes, we, we will try escape to quit. Arrow keys to move. Z and X. Use warp, use ladder. Okay. And uh, that's actually a game from Threddy, uh, which is a, a really nice developer that uh, followed along uh, my devlogs uh, on Lura. So yeah, I was uh, pretty uh, eager to play this game. It's a Windows game. I have it somewhere. I will try to launch the game. There is no screen, it seems, in the options. No. So I will share the game. I'm not sure how it will look. Uh, on the live. Oh, okay. It doesn't look good. Uh, so we will play this one a bit later, actually, uh, and we we'll go along with uh, the brother games. Sorry. Uh, next time. So next game, Auburn. Oh yeah, so Auburn is an adventure game in which a lonely fox makes friends with the animals around her. Was creating during the lowest jam. Okay, so it's an adventure game. Move arrows or rest, jump, space, R W, interact. Okay. Uh, so it was made by Little Martian. Yeah, Craig Smith, which uh, uh, Craig uh, already. Uh, Released uh, is is wor is working on a game actually a game uh, in space. Uh, not sure what type of game it is, but you can see it's the somewhat style, so you can take a look later. Game. I will just check that you have the sound. Yeah. All right. Okay. First. Let's go. Okay, jump. Auburn in France. Oh, the B. Look at this B. Four, four pixels. One B. Um, what was the B again? I will just look at. We just look back. Jump. Enter. Okay. Oh, 
Oh, okay. I'd better not. And I heal. Alright. Yeah, the beast busy with uh, the flower. Oh! I'm not eating that. Okay. Doesn't like mushrooms. Uh, you know what? Let's go left. Game is beautiful, actually. Oh, I can interact with the fish. Yo, fish. <laughs> hey, what? Okay. Fish doesn't. I can use the fish. All right. Go right then. I love the music. Really cool. Oh, it's moving. <laughs> nice. Um, maybe it's a bit hard to see. Uh, like, I thought that this was a wall. You know? I was not sure if it was in the background or the foreground. Did I ever say that I'm afraid of the dark? Okay. Okay, 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 okay. So I can go there when I try to move right. This place. The uh, dialogue. Okay. There's a lever. Activate the lights. It's really cute. The dialogue box is very cute. Actually, with the, the character head. Uh, but uh, yeah, kind of hard to read because you <laughs> really have only one word at a time. Oh, that's nice. It's changing color when in the, in the water. Let's use that. Yeah, this resolution, in, it can feel a bit, um, how do you say? Like, you can really see pixels moving. It can be uh, hard to look at. That's why uh, the developer said in one of, the, of his tweets that uh, he was using uh, actually the... You can see there's no scrolling. You go from screen to screen and that helps that. It's a worm. You probably can't tell what I'm saying. Just like all the other animals. <laughs> okay. But it seems that, like I will be able to do things with the other animals, but right now I'm missing something. Like there is a lot of interaction with the with the level. It's really nice. Okay, so I can't move this boulder. Alright. If I can't do anything down here, I'll just go up and uh, go to the right. But yeah, really, really pretty game. Can I go there? Okay, I can go there. But I go there first. Okay. Ooh. A giant rock with a chicken carved into it. Maybe I'll press it. Whoa, what was that? I feel different. Okay, so maybe now I have the power to use a chicken. That must be uh, somewhere. Water as far can see. Okay, not this way then. But I'm not. I'm not sure I've seen any chicken so far. Oh, can I go there? No, okay. This must be clouds. Yeah, more tulips. <coughs> yeah. 
Okay. And I go down here. So did I miss a chicken? Um so that's elevator. But so down here I can't do anything. There is only the worm. Um maybe I should really go back to the start. And uh Maybe I shouldn't fall this time. Yeah. I wonder if you should remove the interactions with the environment once we have read it a few times. Ah! Oh, bring it again. Because I was talking. Because, uh, yeah, well. It's not that bothering, but now I'm I just want to read that again. Okay. Okay, let's be careful this time. The next one. No. Okay. <laughs> Further than I thought. Okay. Nice. So there's the B. There's the beginning of the level. And I go... Okay, I can go down there. And there's the chicken. He's then on the left of the screen. Where player never goes... Ne player never goes left. They always go right. So oh, that's funny. Good morning. Oh, uh, fox. Not going to eat you. That's a relief. Can we be friends? I'd like that. Oh, that's that's cute. Would you like an adventure? Sure. Hey, what was that? I'm not sure. Okay. So now I control the chicken and there is this blue thing on the fox. Maybe just to tell me that I'm controlling the chicken right now. But what, ca what can I do with the chicken? Oh. Okay. There's something in there. So I can fly a little bit. I can fly up, but I can at least uh, do this. Okay. I think this is what I should do. Oh, so close. Maybe it's not that. Maybe. I shouldn't do that, but... No. I, w I will take... Maybe there's something I didn't grasp. Oh, yeah. Oh, I don't have to spam like that, actually. I can just hold space, I think. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay, way easier. Okay. So there's absolutely no explanation on the controls, but I think it's okay because, you know, you have only one key, interact key, action key, so you can learn. People can learn. Don't have to tell them everything. Okay, fish rock. There's nothing around here. Okay, let's unlock the fish then. It's so pretty. <laughs> Hey, Auburn, can you hear me down there? Yep, are you okay? There's a well. Proceed. Okay, here he goes. All right. So now we have the fish. Mm, I think only Auburn has the power, though. So I would say I need to, yeah. Get Auburn back and go to the fish. Yeah, the bee I can't use. Fish was here. The blue fish. Yo, fish. Oh, hello. You're a fox, right? Don't see many fox around these parts. I'm exploring. Friends? Just like that. Friends? Yeah. Let's go. It's a cute world. Okay, maybe I can go down. 
Oh, the music. Really like that chest. Look at those walking. Right. And this is the worm rock. What happens if I just... Yep. All right. We unlock the worms. The worm. There's no way I'll be able to get past the next version. <laughs> okay. I hope there will be a next version. Okay, let's go back and try to use the worm. The worm was on the wall. So maybe we'll be able to climb on the walls with the worm. So yeah, there, there's no challenge. Maybe the, the the chicken thing was a bit challenging because you have to figure out how to use the, the fish and then um, yeah, even the fish was a bit hard to find. Uh, the chicken, sorry. But the fish was... Uh, there was no challenge. But uh, it's really not the point of the game. Hello, Rome, can you hear me? Well, I have no car, no ears, but let's, <laughs> let's not let that spoil the story. <laughs> Great. Can we be friends? And are you up in fun? Okay. Hang on, what was that? Oh, it's bets. Just go along. Okay. Yeah. I can go on the walls. That's what I thought I've seen on the Twitter. Okay. So this one will be able move past the boulder and here is the bee rock and that may be the last animal oh yeah okay i have it let's just go back then oh yeah it's not very changing but it's funny it's cute and uh you know you're following the adventure of these little animals um, maybe there, there is potential for more harder puzzles. I I really feel like it's missing at least a puzzle, you know? Like, here I was just walking on the walls and there's no think thinking, but yeah, I don't know. If, uh, if, if it's what uh, the developer wanted to do, I, I, I guess it's okay. It's just a small relaxing game. Like, yeah, because it's very relaxing, actually. Uh, uh, yeah, the B. I have to get back at the start. You know, with the jump, I'm always missing. <laughs> I'm scared now. Okay. All right. And the B. A B. Let's be friend. Oh, you know what I'm saying. I always did. But I thought didn't like me. Oh. Friends. Oh, too bad. No, no B joke. Adventure. Yes. Okay. Okay, so I control the B. Can I fly up? No. Can I fly right and go to the infinite water? Because I don't think there is any other place that I should... Hey, can I do that? Beautiful nectar. Oh, right. <laughs> okay. So here's the chicken rock. And here's the water. Yeah. I can go past the water. The music is increasing. Something is gonna happen. What's that? Boxing glove. Means just turn the object to find. Right. 
looking for buried treasure on this island. Yes, I think the buried treasure is just below, actually. It so there's nothing to do. And there is an empty rock. Maybe there will be more animals cover in the next version. Nice! But I think it's the end of the game. Because there's nothing to do now. Okay. Yeah, so... A really nice game. Like, music is great. Graphics are really great. I mean, the resolution is almost not a constraint here. Um, and yeah, it's very relaxing. Uh, the world is uh, is nice. Um, maybe yeah, I would I add maybe like puzzles to solve with the different uh, animals. Uh, but that's good, like that. So yeah, well done, done with Auburn. Okay, what do we have next? Refresh page. Um, uh, I would just get the chat. Oh, there was a uh, information on the jump page. Oh yeah, with the abilities here, old jump to climb and all. You're right. Okay, yeah, missed that. Actually, just with the controls. All right, let's go. So. I just don't know anymore. So I, I've talked a little with the creator, which is uh, Sander. And uh, yeah, you can see there, he really likes shaders. And he said it was a really personal game. Oh yeah, we'll see. Uh, if you have the, if you have a headphones, you should put them. Uh, turn five minutes play time, so it Controls. Try to find a heart. Okay, so we can move it. Thing, space, search. Oh, okay. I'm not. I'm not using Firefox, so that's fine. Okay, let's play. It was made with a dot. I just don't know anymore. I can use the mouse. Whoa, intense. times oh, okay it should look like this I find the out oh oh okay so I'm I have to find the out very fast to fill the gauge What are those? Maybe I, I just... Okay, so I need to find the hearts, but this time I need to avoid these guys. 
I'm actually just spamming space. Obstacles. Where is the art? It's really hard to see the art right now because of the lights and all. Okay, and I have to restart. music uh yeah it, it's really sunder that did the music uh, he was sharing that on uh, twitter i thought i could i thought i'd fix us i thought i thought i could okay. from the things in which i'll miss her Wish I kissed her when I could And from the things in which I'll miss her I wish I kissed her when I could And from the things in which I'll miss her I wish I kissed her when I could And from the things in which I'll miss her I wish I kissed her when I could And from the things in which I'll miss her I wish I could I'm very curious what's gonna happen at the end. Because there is this tree growing. Yeah, but the music is finished, so. Yeah, it's finished. So, yeah, pretty nice game. Um, yeah, you can already. Uh, there, There is a heartbreaking story behind that. So, yeah, it's a personal game. Uh, I imagine maybe. Um, he was talking of a, of a previous uh, love uh, or something. Uh, very, very brave to uh, create uh, some experience like that to, uh, to talk about this. And uh, yeah, there is still gameplay with the kind of top-down movement. It's kind of a shoot them up actually. It's like you have to move around on the on the screen, and there are like things to. Uh, some obstacles. Uh, yeah, pretty good. Let's play the next one. I will take a look at the at the chat. <laughs> yeah, hello, bad piggy. Yeah, really pretty rare to rare to see uh, vocals. Okay, let's go with Magnus Inter EOS. Not sure if I'm saying it right. Okay, so I can already say it's a bit hard to read that. <laughs> uh, so an infinite spacecraft floats along the cosmos and operating Magnus is being sent to contain the threat. The Amogi have been observed to spread like a cancer throughout space and without proper decontamination, there will be no end to them. 
Um, okay, so that's a disease. Or maybe just ions. Common believes one man and a flamethrower are all that's necessary for the task. So I thought they are like this and smog out from every vent the malicious somebody. Okay, so we're going to kill a lot of things with a flamethrower. The game doesn't have a, have a large gold setup at the moment. The game ends at the when the player dies or the player decides to kill the final boss. Alright, so we'll kill the final boss. Both of which are rather easy to do. Nice. Enemies will keep spawning throughout the game, so always be aware and stay on the move. Control WSD and move mouse we aim the flame. Left click to let the flames roar. However, the flames can only stay on for a bit and have to recharge, essentially. Okay. Classic uh, flamethrower uh, thing. Overloading gun. The time to run and refill are rather short. Hour. We might expand upon this in the future. At the moment, our team has just been trying to get into the groove of making games, and for the first time, our assumption isn't late. <laughs> Congr congratulations on that. Uh, so we like to think we're making progress. Yeah, you're making progress. So these are the the three persons who worked on the game. Okay, let's play Unity game. Magnus Eos. Operator Magnus, I'm sure you're already aware of importance of this mission. There's been an excessive amount of reports of Ambuggy breakout and a <laughs> Okay, so the guy is actually firing. Oh, I think there is an enemy in the dialogue box. Whoa, okay, I didn't read the thing yet. That that's that's a bit aggressive, huh? you know. You should let the player read the, the tutorial before. Command is only to rest letting cruise of thought about space with possible, so you must go in and if necessary fumigate the spacecraft. The protocol detects a full team should be sent for this in person, but with good luck. Okay, good luck earlier. Alright. So it's gonna be hard. Wait. All these like It's the Oh how this name is called. You no know the game we have with the spaceman uh, and you're in uh, space, and uh, it's like Le uh, Garou de Tiersolieu, Wolves of uh, Among Us. Yeah, that's definitely Among Us sprites. Well, I mean, it's not the same, but uh, yeah, definitely looks like it. I mean, the design is pretty simple anyway, so. Okay. So I need to find the boss. Don't really care about all these guys because they respawn. There's a pin. Wait. Let's go up there. Okay, let's be careful not to run out of flame. Um, I really like the idea of having. A a very, very few colors, like uh, like you were playing uh, Game Boy games. Game Boy game. Um, you have blue actually, just there. Mm. Yeah, con controls are fine, and yeah, you can shoot around uh, pretty easily. Maybe it's missing something to know when you are overloading overloading the weapon. When the weapon is uh, reloading, I mean. Because right now you have no way of knowing. No, well, it's okay. But maybe it's a feedback you, you could add. Uh, but I, I really like how minimalist this looks. There is no UI. Okay. I think I'm taking too long and tons of people. Okay. Whoa! Unity crashed. Let's launch the game again. Okay, so 
the boss wasn't up there. So let's just pass this dialogue and go directly to the right. And fast before there is too much um, Amigi. Amigi. Don't remember the name. I can't open doors, right? Okay. Uh, no HP. No life point. No HP. So, it's true that I did not realize how I died sooner. Uh, because uh, I don't know how many HP I have. I guess it's like I'm dead in one shot, but uh, don't be sure. So, there seems to be like strange things over there. They were doing experiments in there on humans. Uh, is this again just a room for decoration or will I find something? Yeah, okay. It's not there. Let's, let's just go right again. So, there's no minimap, so yeah. Will be difficult to know where, where I am exactly. But, I guess, just play again and, and remember what you did. Okay, so I can go right or left. Let's go right. I this what happened? Did I just go into another level? Architect Architect Amogus. Okay, so that's the boss. Good luck, soldier. Yeah. Oh no, the dialogue is back again. Okay. I don't need to. I can just do that actually, because there are flames on the guy, and I guess they are taking damage while they are in flames. Not sure. Not, not enough feedback to, to know for sure. So where's the boss? Yeah. I'm lost. Really hard to navigate. Don't know where I should go. Ah, music is really nice. I'm jumping around on my desktop. My desk. Uh, okay, so that's the start of the game. So actually, we have the bodies of the Ami Amigi around and that's helpful because that's where this way I know for sure I can know for sure where I went okay let's try one more time and then I can't win I get to another key so there's a lot of room I can ignore. I think it was this way. At some point, I will go down. No enemy at all on this path. That's good. Let's go down. It was on the right, I think. Just there. Whoa. Okay. So let's go up and right. And these guys are, are running fast. Were they running like that before? Not sure. Maybe. Oh, there's a lot of... Um, shoot a sack. French. Okay, so that was not the way. Yeah, I'm just gonna die again.
Yeah, this spoke when I shoot at them, so... Maybe I can just... No, I don't stop. It's slow. Yeah, music is really nice. Am I going back where I was? Yeah. Okay. But you know what? Let's just do the same. I go down as much as much as I can. And I go right. Whoa. <laughs> this guy is just falling on me. Whoa different so yeah again the answer was go down and right and down yeah I can let them die oh no is there another level like that <laughs> please Give me the boss. Yeah, I think the biggest problem is really navigation. Because the screen is very small, so I can see only a very small part of the of the room. And it's like, you know, every you have only four colors. I can't see a thing. There is not a lot of landmarks. So yeah, it's easy to get lost. A very big map. I'm re okay. Let's go down. I I'm not coming. Game over. Okay, I'm not sure why. Uh, I stopped there. Uh, yeah, but it was uh, a good game. Um, congratulations uh, on trying to finish the game. Uh, for game jam. Uh, really nice. And uh, yeah, I'm missing a, a bit of uh, map thing, indications, but uh, override, great start. Um, let's look again at the chat. KCP. They are the lowest game. Oh yeah, I didn't mention it, but um, as you can see, uh, you can make donations on uh, coffee and uh, 500. I will play some uh, every lowest jump game. I hope that's not gonna happen because uh, there is a lot of games. So let's play the next one. Been playing for an hour. So, Hunger. It's an hour oh, game. Oh, I, I hate our game, actually. I'm, I'm too scared for them. Can you escape the clutches of the always angry beast? Okay. No, no more indications. I do. Yes. Whoa, that's a really nice splash screen. Yeah, jump scares and machine light. Great. Oh. There is actually a save system. Looks like it. But yeah, WSD I can move. Space. Act. Nice. Like the splash screen, the splash screen is. <laughs> Please don't love. Uh, objective: find source of the noise. All right. Oh, just picked. Is this key or the door? Sure. 
So I can jump, move around. So this is. And I can pick up only one item at a time. And enter in there. Bed with pearl. Things. Need another key. Right. Search for key. I'll just take it back. Now the goal is to. Okay, so there is sound on the left. So I guess, like, maybe there is an enemy. Go away! So there was a nut on the table. I've just about had it with my data again. Oh, but. There. Button. Can't pick it up. That. Oh, okay, so I pressed down. Okay, just lucky. Not the good key. back well yeah that yeah there's a monster so I'm just gonna I just hide in there and do things yeah yeah What's this? Oh. In. So I guess he can like spawn like times. Just avoid him by going in another room. I just don't. You know I'm already scared. Just the sound and seeing the what's what's this? Oh! <laughs> All right. <clears throat> yeah, I'm sorry. I'm gonna. <laughs> I really don't like this kind of game. I'm not like all the the streamer that they came to because people love to see other people being scared. But otherwise, yeah, I really like the splash game. And uh, yeah, the game looks uh, very good in this resolution. And uh, yeah, it's scary. So, scary for me. Take a look at the chat. All right. Next game. Wrecked. Wrecked. It's a card game about personalities. It's not finished. Okay. And it was actually made by Jack, which is the James Host. Host. Tutorial. Oh, there's a tutorial. Let's read it. The overload map contains points where you meet people you have to get with. After winning each engagement, you go to the next part until you reach the end. Okay. During an engagement, you play cards against your opponent. There are two types of cards, elements and aspects. Aspects have attack and death skills, as well as preferred elements. Shown as the background of the card. Okay. Which has plus one to skill being used. If you're attacking, you get plus one to attack. If you're defending, you get plus one to defend. Whoa, okay. The goal is if to match the opponent is to match the opponent's cards, defense with your cards attack. And when able to attack the opponent, going to zero. 
You play cards by clicking them and placing them on the board. To attack, you simply click a placed aspect. When you win an engagement, you will also be rewarded with new cards that will help you. You can manage your deck from the overworld via the deck manager. Simply select the two cards you want to swap them. Click swap it. All right, let's try. The full screen. Okay. Never should have gotten on a ship named Rex. Just gonna lower the sound a little. This game seems to be pretty loud. Alright. Where are you? What are all these people saying? You washed up on the beach, so that's nice. Deck manager. Okay, so these are my cards with elements, I guess. Air, water, joy, hope. This, I don't know what this is. Maybe to exchange cards later. Maybe this is my reserve of cards. This is to come back. All right. And this is the overworld. So let's start. You approach a smelly snoring bun on the beach. Does he live here? Water element, joy aspect, hope aspect. Water element, hope aspect. Okay, I, I think I don't get it. <laughs> I, I, I will read the thing again. Um, okay. So this is a water aspect. All right, and and these two hope aspects have a bonus with water, if I'm if I understand. So here it's gonna be water. Red is the hit points, I think. Defense points, and green is the attack, or maybe it's the other way around. But I should have plus one. Thanks to the water, and this one should not. We played water, so I will play again a water card. It's done the same, so it should be a draw there. Um, I have some air cards, so I'll put an element. He's using a card with water, so yeah, I play that, and I should be aim on this. And I don't have a lot of choice here, just that. Oh, I, I was expecting something there, like to happen. Uh, I guess this is my hit points. The music stopped. Notice. Uh, maybe I can. Okay, so we can keep playing and change the cards. Can I change his card? No. And, uh, but um, really I'm pretty good with how cards are right now. Let's do that. Right. That. And that. He removed this card, so. That would mean that I will be able to... Can I remove my card? How did it... Wait... No... I think that there is something missing in the tutorial, because, like, I just... I don't know what I did there, but... them to pass my turn. I, I can't do anything right now. What should I do? Oh, okay. Now I can. 
I am king all of his cards. Okay. So I should click on the card to attack. And here it is draw. So it doesn't do anything. Here, same, it's a draw. Here I should win. I'm not winning. Right. No one is doing anything. <laughs> uh, yeah. If the bot is not doing anything, I think it's the end. You won. All right. Maybe the bot just gave up. Or maybe there is a fixed amount of turns that is not shown to us. And uh, he had uh, the bot has at least. HP than me. You are a different memory card. So life card, memory card. All right. Let's look at the day. Life memory. So I guess I I can't have more cards in my hands, but I can replace them. So I have a lot of draw cards. Jeez, I will replace some and memory. Not sure what these are going to do, but I want to see, so we'll see that in the next battle. Seems to be at least four battles, maybe more. A surfer clutching a plank of wood emerges from the ocean below Vraki. Okay, so I, I've picked up the card. What is so that's a memory aspect. Uh, and it has three attacks, two defense. So that's pretty strong. But I don't have the element. So yeah, I need to be careful with that. And I will start with that, actually. Putting water over there. Um, oh, did I just throw away my two only? Uh, air card is I'm noticing it's gonna be hard. All right, yes, okay, so it can kill me, and I can't kill it. Yeah, um, but I can attack it there. Yeah, he lost one point. Now he has some defenses, but I can't kill them. Oh, I can't. This is water, right? So, uh, oh, maybe, okay, so no, red is the attack. That's why he only, he only lost one point. So red is the attack. Green is the life. So can't kill my book. Some air card here, and I can kill this one. I can't kill this. Um, oh, yes, I'm I have the okay. I didn't throw the cards, just have them. Um, hmm. So, maybe one thing I could do. Let's do that. Okay, it's gone for a water element, but I don't care for now. I just kill and I replace it with a water aspect and kill this guy and kill this guy also. And I just win. Yeah. Uh, you know what? It's funny. I really like the game. It's really funny. Uh, maybe the tutorial is <laughs> really a bit hard to understand. But uh, yeah, with two jewels, I yeah, I feel like I'm, I'm getting it. Don't need any any more information. A fisherman stops you from eating his fish. Famous beat bad fish. Oh, I forgot to check my deck. Can I go back? I can't. 
All right. Let's hope this guy is not too. So let's attack it. You know what? Let's be. Uh, so if I attack, I can't do anything. Actually, maybe you should. Well, I mean, you said it yourself. It's missing a lot of feedback and such. But yeah, it's true that I should be aware that if I attack, it's going to be use useless. Like here, I have two attack. He has two defense. It's going to do nothing, but I can still attack. So at least I think it, I can still attack. I could in the other game, I think. Um, yeah, let's. Let's get. Oh, yeah, well, go on. Put some water over there. So, yeah, here it's locked. I'm right. Unless I change this card for another one. You know what? Let's continue to put this one. Yeah. I think it's HP. Right. Um, this one is pretty weak. Um, yeah, choose this one. It's water. Oh, I use this one here. All right, it's, it's a draw there, so no worries. Again, and again. And this is done. You are already the Earth Crawl. Alright. Uh, uh, take my job. So I have another memory card and an Earth Crawl. So I need the life card for the book. I, I, I change that. Uh, memory card is the book, and it's way stronger than uh, hope. I think it was hope that was using. So I just remove water. Curse. I have love, so maybe love. Let's... Oh. I remove the hope and don't. I don't need water anymore. I just use curse now. A life. Goat. Guard. With a loud whistle comes after you. You wish his whistle was quieter. Nice to have this little text, little dialogue before each fight. Okay, let's go strong. I have a lot of aspect elements, sorry. And only one aspect. Not doing anything. Okay, I just attacked it. And again. Uh, yeah, this one is buggy, right? <laughs> okay. You're already in an Earth card. Love card. Yeah. Let's use them. Um, so I remove one joy and one air. Because I didn't use this yet, but I want to see. So more battle, four more battles. That's great. You awake to two farm children poking you with a stick, not to the kids. Let's beat these kids. Okay, th that's fine. Okay, so that's a draw. Um, you know what? Another book. Let's stop say book. To memory. Another draw, alright. Whoa, love is very strong. Uh, what's what's the buttering here? <laughs> like, 
He's the bot is using strong cards. So good thing I've changed mine. But uh, yeah, it's only gonna be draw for now. Unless unless he has a stronger card than this one. I can lose a love, love aspect just to make it a draw. And now nothing's going to happen and I should win at some point. Yeah, nothing's going to happen. So I think there is a timer and I will win at some point. I feel like the AI is like feel like it's possible to have a lot of draws because of how the AI is playing. I'm not sure. Is it going to stop at some point? Because I won't do anything. I, I can't do anything. I just, maybe I need to have no more cards in the hand. So let's do this. And this. And I have no cards. Go on. Yeah. <laughs> I'm spamming the click. But looks like not doing anything. Not sure how, how I won time. Yeah, that's a bummer. Actually. I can't do it. Oh, maybe I... I will have to stop. That's too bad. I really wanted to go further. I really like this kind of game. But... Like, but doesn't want to play. So yeah, the bot is just like attacking my uh, cards and it's doing nothing. I am attacking the bot's card and it's doing nothing either because we are we we are uh, always doing draws. Yeah. All right. Okay, I'm going to stop there. But uh, yeah, I hope uh, it would be nice to more about the game. But uh, I mean, it was just a test for an ID. Really good test. I love it. Well done, guys. Game. A game. A puzzle game. You see how stupid I am. Wait. Oh, the chats. Okay, bye, uh, bye, Jeremy. Actually, a bit late. Oh, goes to this uh, puzzle game with crates, pushing, and lasers. So maybe Sokoban style. Goes to destroy all red and green bombs on the level using the laser beam of the respective color. Okay, so there are going there, there are going to be laser, red and green laser beam, and I have to reflect them on the red and green bombs. Push reflective crates. Okay, so the crates are reflective to redirect your laser beam throughout the stage. When all bombs are destroyed, proceed to the designated exit. In crumbs, are you going to do? All right. Object. Not full screen. Beam scheme. Yeah. I love when a game starts like that with music. Uh, very cool music. Space to pull. Yeah, very simple. So that's my character. 
But yeah, it look like, looks like a drone, a robot. And yeah, we can see that we have something like a magnet. Yeah, so if I keep space, hold, I can push things. I, I can bring back things. So this is reflecting it. What's this? Is it a bomb? No, just a green thing. This is a bomb. Can I? No, I can't push the bomb. I can do anything. Okay, maybe we need to go a little higher. Okay, a little higher again. A little higher again. Can be higher than that, so. Yeah! Okay, and this is the end of the level. Let's go there. Ooh. Okay, so two bombs and a wall in the middle and the crates are here. I have two crates. So how how am I gonna do that? Oh, okay. Once the bomb is destroyed, you can actually, uh, the, the, well, the bomb is destroyed, so the beam can go, can go, can continue to, to move. All right. Oh wait. What what am I doing here? No, go back. So if I put it there, it's okay. Yeah, that's fun. And the game is, uh, yeah, it looks looks nice. Oh, okay. So we have reflective walls now. For now, there is only uh, red bombs. So I guess it's gonna get. Uh, harder later. Let's do that. Oh yeah, and he's missing with everything. So we got the bomb up there, and we got this one. Oh yeah, this was easier than uh, than it looks. And it looked. All right. So let's just kill. This one here. Whoa! But <laughs> I have to say, that's actually not like not what I was thinking at all. But it worked. Okay, so what happens if I just do nothing? Just go there. So I have to use that this way. And then use it. I have another crate down here, so that will be useful. Oh, okay, got an idea. So we can do that. Like this. Okay, so that's for the with the game because I, mean, I was just trying to figure out how to do it. I think I, I had a good way to do it, but by accident, I killed it. Like the beam, look at how the beam is all over the place. And we're only at like level three or four. All right. Uh, you know what? Let's just that and that. But yeah, it's kind of hard. I have, I have some difficulties to think clearly. Like this one is a must have. Right, I'm doing things with one. Um, I have to take into account the reflective walls because that really is. can create a big mess like that. So maybe I can just that actually try. No, it's not 
a perfect thing for what it would. Hmm. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Need to think a little bit. <laughs> All right. Okay. Only red beams. And two crates. So there is this crate over here. I think I can get it like that. All right. And maybe I can use this one. Oh. Wait. Okay. Oh, okay. You need to find something else. Yeah. That looks very good. them this and this right nice game all right so i can reflect them okay so just like that <clears throat> Right. Maybe I can create more confusion with this one. Bring this way. Oh no 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 no. I don't want this to go this way. Yeah. Okay. The game is really cool because, like, makes you feel really clever. More clever than actually I am, I think. Because um, I wasn't sure there on the last move what I should do. But, you know, it's kind of messy, so it works. Three bombs. Didn't get to see uh, green bombs. Whoa. There's a lot of bombs and very few crates. Maybe it will, it will just like, yeah, that's why I thought. <laughs> and I, maybe I can even do that. Oh no. All right. Well, let's do that. And let's use this one to finish them up. One got this one too. Oh, okay. I have to say, was not expecting this one to go. Hmm. Oh, but I didn't notice I have another crate here. That might really help. This way. Okay, so if I actually have another crate, I can do some crazy stuff like this. At some point, you're starting to get the hang of it. Oh, I hope it's gonna work. Okay, it doesn't work. Right. Yeah, yeah. What can I do? The music is starting to gather my nerves though.
Oh yeah. Can use the third one here. I think. Maybe not. No, it's gonna go the other way. Huh. Oh, I think I can do something with that. Need to go around to push it. Go this way. And this way. Okay, maybe uh, we need to do that. And that. That. No! Okay. Uh, you know, I'm not very patient, so I think I... I stop here. Because, uh, yeah, we'll be almost at the end of the live and still have a game to play. Well, I have uh, tons of game to play, actually, again, but... For today, oh, that might work for this one. Oh, uh, you know what? Maybe I can just do crazy stuff, and at some point I will by accident. <laughs> Oh! Can I do something here? Yeah! Got... Uh, still have another one to... Uh, I don't know if I'm... Gonna have it. Maybe the... There is a simple... No, I don't have any choice. Needs to be here. Then it goes through all these things. And come back here. I need to get to the right thing. Can I do that? No, I can't. I can't. Oh, maybe I can. I think I've. Oh, I think I've. Oh. It didn't work. And I, I can't bring it here. Oh, yes, I can, but. Oh. <laughs> oh! What? Okay. <laughs> yeah. I got it. But well, I'm sure it's not the last level, right? Uh, no. I'm coming from here. Right? Oh, I'm, no, no. This way. Okay, I'm coming from here, but the door is here. Oh, these are the green beam. So, I wonder how difficult it really is with the green beam added, because I can of, I don't really care, right? I can just do reds, and when I'm done with the red one, the green one, okay, so that doesn't work. I won't have a lot of solutions there because I have only one crate. Yeah. Well, 
espada de Mei. If there is one angle that is going to work, yes, this one. So now that the red is done, I just have to do the green one. For me, it doesn't change anything, but maybe later. Ah, oh, yeah. Alright. This one, uh, this level was easier. But I guess it's normal because you're introducing the, the new beam. And you really put a hard work in the, the levels because this looks really complicated. All right, uh, I have two crates. Ah. All right. Like, really hard to get the, the crates over there. Actually. So, I think I need to in the, the green bombs before. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna do the level, I think. I've played this game for like almost 30 minutes, I think. So, yeah, but it's really good. And uh, yeah, viewers, you should play this game and finish it and be clever, more clever than me. Yeah. So, yeah. It was, uh, what was the name? Beam Scheme. Very nice game. And let's play one last for this session. Garden Gurner. This old farmer guy was just planting his crops, but then an apocalypse happened. I am. I'm so. Okay. He modified his, his seeds to grow guns. But depending on the seed, it will grow a gun based on plants it grows. Alright. Drag the seed on the the dirt patch and wait for it to grow. When it's done growing a random gun, it will appear and shoot at your mouse, depending on what gun it is. Kill the enemies and get Okay, level 1, level 2, level 3, level 4. And the boss. So let's get to the boss. Oof. I can first. Oh. Let me take a look. Chat. Alright. So it's a mouse game. Is our seed that seems to be yeah that's clever that's a really clever menu actually like you, you can learn easily the game and, uh, and it's very clever yeah good, good time I, I really like when game games are doing this kind of thing. Like uh, I've just lost one HP, I think. Oh, I just lost. All right. You have only one HP. Above is the score. All right. I need to get to 175, I think. Not sure I'm gonna do it. Because I'm kind of bad. But you just need to remember to get back your seed, actually. Oh, this one was fine a lot. And if you're fast enough, you can plant several seeds. Yeah. 
Yeah, I'm really focused there. What's that? Is it an enemy that is going... What's... What's this? Can I plant that? What? No! Alright. Yeah, I know. I lo I lo I've lost. Alright. Let's try again. So yeah, pretty neat uh, concept. Your feedback. Like, the thing is loading, you can see it really clearly. Uh, the World on Troid thing is... Un touch. What? Okay. But yeah, it's funny to have the one bomb gun, but uh, yeah, kind of hard to know if it's gonna take time or not. Like, now I have two seats, but I'm not sure. Why? Ah! Yeah, Misclick is uh, really unforgivable in this game. Oh, this one shoots, uh, so purple shoots three times. Purple shoots, okay, no, it's not purple. No, okay. I thought like the purple color was going to indicate what type of gun you have, but uh, it's not. That's too bad. I was starting to get strategy there, but... Uh... Oh, it's not on the terrain. Okay, I'm dead again. Okay. Well, I stopped there, but uh, it was nice. Cool. Uh, yeah, we didn't... Yeah, so... That's gonna be it for this session. Uh, played a lot of games, that was cool. Um, tomorrow I play again. Uh, at uh, 3 EST, same hour. And... Um, I will play the games. A ton of games were sent on Twitter, so I will play those. But uh, please feel free to let a comment uh, with your game, or maybe um, go directly on Twitter and uh, let me your game. So yeah, see you next time.